Trump spent Thursday morning on Twitter attempting to pressure Republicans to back him on the issue. A big national emergency vote today by the United States Senate on border security and the wall, which is already under major construction, said Trump. I am prepared to veto, if necessary. The southern border is a national security and humanitarian nightmare, but it can be easily fixed. The Democrats are border deniers. They refuse to see or acknowledge the death, crime, drugs, and human trafficking at our southern border, he wrote later, adding, a vote for today's resolution by Republican senators is a vote for Nancy Pelosi, crime, and the open border Democrats. The Senate vote was outside of Majority Leader Mitch McConnell's control as it was triggered by the passage of the resolution in the House, where 13 Republicans joined Democrats in a 245 to 182 tally. Neither margin would be large enough to override a presidential veto, but both chambers voting to defy Trump for the first time in his presidency is a major setback, at a time when numerous House committees are launching investigations of his campaign, administration, and personal business. The wall is also facing legal challenges which could be aided by Trump's own admission that I could do the wall over a longer period of time. I didn't need to do this. Legislation proposed by Senator Mike Lee, R. Utah, would have restricted future emergency declarations from presidents while allowing Trump's but he couldn't reach a compromise agreement with the White House and the plan fizzled.